Hi, thanks for watching. In this episode, I'll explain clearly how to use a whip finishing tool. And as you can see, I have a very basic model here. Nothing fancy, uh, but I actually prefer this one. So let's get started. Okay, so I've put a uh, hook just for demonstration in the vise. And I'm just gonna quickly attach my thread here for you. A couple of wraps and trim away the excess. So when you finish your fly and you come up to the, to the head of your fly and it's time for your whip finish, uh, basically what you do, you lengthen your thread just a little bit, take your whip finishing tool and the first thing you'll do is you'll take this little hook and you'll put it on top of your thread and catch it. Okay. Now once you've done that, you'll take your thread and you'll take it around the indent on the whip finishing tool, just like that. Then you turn your whip finishing tool so that your uh, tying thread is in a horizontal position. Okay. And as you can see, I'm making the number four here. And the thread that's coming off my hook is on the back and the thread that's coming off of my bobbin is in the front, okay? This is in the front, keeping everything horizontal and just make your wraps. One, two, three, four in this case. Now what you'll do is you'll take the thread off the indent and you keep the hook attached. And then you keep a little bit of tension on your thread with that hook, pull your thread down. And when you're at your uh, hook shank, release the hook, tighten it, take your scissors and trim away and that's your whip finish. Catch it with the hook, wrap it around the indent and twist, making the number four, keeping everything horizontal and I'll just make my wraps, one, two, three, four, five in this case. I'll release the thread from the indent and I'll gradually pull down and when I hit the uh, shank of the hook, I'll release the hook, tighten, trim away and I have a perfect whip finish. So let's show me the. <clears throat> so let's show you uh, from a different position. Again, catch it with the hook around the indent, keeping everything horizontal. One, two, three, four, five wraps. Release the indent, pull down, and actually when the hook is touching the uh, the hook shank, I'll release it, pull down, tighten it, trim away, and we have a perfect whip finish.